speak three languages. I have read hundreds of books. I have walked literally thousands of kilometers in my bare feet. My dad was Dinka. My mom is Somali, but I don't look like her. I'm half Somali, but to Somalis, I am not one of them. My mother's world ended when my father's world burned up in a war. And now, I, I, I live here surrounded by savages. So, you don't know me. You don't know what I have lived through. What I have seen, how much I have bled. What I have had to do to survive. And you think you can judge me? You think you have got my number? Dude, I'm not a joy rider. Okay, okay, technically, yeah, I'm a joy rider. Seriously, like, I don't procure the cars, I just ride in them. So, I'm not a joy stealer per se, just a joy rider. <laughs> yeah, I've heard people talk shit about us, about Somalis. Even heard some morons say we don't take care of our families. You wanna know why so many of us are poor? Cause our dads are working two jobs, paying for eight kids, and sending money to a hundred relatives around the world who struggle just to stay alive. And some bug nuts is gonna say we don't care about our families. 80% of people are lead. They're dull, unreflective, unconductive, mentally dead. 10% are pyrite. Fool's gold. Fooling the lost in the savage land into thinking they have something of value but keeping them poor and believing in lies. But then there are those who possess the true and living gold. Who transform the people of lead into people of gold and bring conductive, reflective gold and light to the world and I can make you one of them.